What's going on YouTube? Welcome to the channel, welcome to the page. This is James from the channel Terribly Tough and I'm excited to bring to you my review on Perfumes de Marley, Haltan. Let's get right into it. I was born to be free Now, my goal here is to help you smell, look, and feel good. If I could do any of the three, I basically did my job. Before we get started, guys, I would love for you guys to like, share, and subscribe. All right, guys, so let's get started with Haltan. Now, Haltan is a sister brand to Initial Parfums. I know a lot of people are gonna instantly say, what about Oud for Greatness? Now, if I were to compare them, which is, let's get that out of the way. Oud for Greatness is a darker, richer scent, very woody. I don't know if you guys like that, but I like fresh and clean. But I like a little bit of zestiness to it. I like a little bit of woods. That oud is an amazing scent. So this would be the cooler, more refreshing, sportier brother. Oud for Greatness is dark and rich. This one is rich also, but it's more on the cleaner level. This one is definitely more of a playboy fragrance. This one is mature as well, but at the same time, it's very playful. You have praline, saffron, this is the type of fragrance that when you smell this in the air or you smell it from the bottle, it's different from a lot of colognes that you have in your collection. When it comes to Parfums de Marley, this is an underslept one because you have late in Harriet, you have a lot of heavy hitters, but Haltan definitely is a go-to fragrance when you're looking for something to impress someone or you're going to a fancy event. This one is an all-season fragrance. This one is something you wear if you want a secret weapon. This is a secret weapon right here. There's nothing that smells like this other than some clones, but they never come close to this. It's very luxurious smelling, rich, it's very dense, potent. On the negative side, I always have to say that you have to be 25 plus to rock this because somebody younger, it's not going to go right because this is more of a sophisticated male. This is a scent that when you're coming to the office and you're dressed right or you're going to a wedding or you're trying to really impress a girl and you're spending all this money on the date, this is the type of fragrance that you put to seal the deal. You don't want to disrespect yourself either and put, you know, sweatpants and a t-shirt on and rock this because now you're smelling rich, but you're not looking rich. You know what I mean? You got to put everything in a well-balanced manner this is a masterpiece this is really nice i love it no complaints it's worth the money it is pricey 440 dollars after taxes but if you have the money buy it if you can't go with Ooh for glory this one will not disappoint you top 10 collection when it comes to compliment getting or most unique smelling scents I like this scent because it basically tells a story about who you are. It tells you that you take life serious, that you have it all well put together, and you're a sophisticated male that's hardworking. You can tell a lot about a person based on the fragrance because if it smells cheap, that's exactly how they think about themselves. That's how you're going to project them. But when you're wearing something rich, something unique, something intriguing, mysterious, that's the scent that basically pulls compliments. That's the ones that turn heads. This is the one that is definitely going to get you to where you need to be in life. I like this because it motivates me. It makes me feel more confident. I walk better. And this is an all around great fragrance. Till next review, this is James from the channel Terribly Tough.